says, I'm missing loads of fruit and veg. You've seen it anywhere? No, I haven't touched it. Really? That's weird. Luca, what are you doing? I'm right. You all right? No, I'm not all right. What is happening here? This is a fruit and veg I know. Right, firstly, that's my idea. And secondly, you've taken loads of stuff that I brought for my video. Don't point fingers, Dad. I'm not pointing fingers. You've obviously taken my stuff. Have I? Yes. But listen, I'm not going to argue about this. You want to do a fruit and veg challenge for your boots. But I'm telling you now, there is no way you're going to eat all of that. <laughs> you only love. Don't get to me. It's not for me. Yeah, mate. Good luck. I don't need luck. Three, two, one. Um, uh, 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 my tummy hurts. I'm never eating fruit ever again. Why don't I do this? Oh, I'm Good morning and welcome to another video and today I'm going to be eating 5,000 calories of fruit and vegetables because I just am. So I figured why not start the day off with a mini challenge. If I can eat this kiwi in 10 seconds, you have to like the video and subscribe to my channel. Is that a deal? 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 That's a deal. Says, can you hold the camera please? I need A, camera holding, stick your stand up, B, uh, a countdown and C, some timekeeping. Get on the stage. Get out of 10 seconds, you backing me? Yeah. You, want, you meant to say no, otherwise it doesn't oh, okay. build the... You backing me? No. Well, that's fighting talk. Three, two, one, go! It doesn't count. It doesn't count. Stop the clock! I'm not opening my mouth. That was definitely 10, wasn't it? That was, that was less than 10 seconds. It was definitely disgusting. Definitely impressive. You have to like the video and subscribe now, otherwise you're a liar and liars go to hell. Right, quick bit of context. Um, so let's hold those. <laughs> we actually took them. So we're in uh, Morocco, more specifically, a little place called Esria. Esria? Eshui, I don't know. Basically, it's just something that sounds a bit like Eshuira. Staying in a cool uh, place. Look at these scenes. Oh my god. Pretty. Sick, am I right? We're kind of like in the middle of nowhere. A Swira town is like, I don't know, somewhere over there. But yeah, been here for a few days. Got a few more days to go. Um, should be good. Who cares? I'm hungry. Let's get some breakfast. Okay, we're in. This should be interesting. Um, so like 5,000 calories. Now I eat close to 5,000 calories most days, right? But doing it at fruit and veg is going to be like a whole different ball game because mainly I guess the fiber, A, the sugar, it's gonna be a massive amount of sugar, B, it's gonna be a massive amount of fiber, probably gonna destroy my internal organs. Uh, let's run through what we have. A massive pomegranate, eight medjool date, a small melon, half a large Sharon fruit, third of a pineapple, and half an apple. So all in all, this comes out 1,450 calories. Add in the orange juice, you've got 1,500 calories, a nice round number. Now on the face of it, I feel like this should be okay to eat. I don't know, I might be kind of overestimating my fruit consumption capacity. By the way, on a side note, medjool dates are ridiculously calorific. One of those is like 67 calories, and you can eat that in like three seconds. Yeah, I'll take it back, it's actually quite hard to eat. The gloopiest thing in the world. Okay, um, let me prepare the pomegranate. Says, how do you get the pomegranate contents out? Whack it on. Whack it. Is this legit? Is this actually a thing? Yeah, whack it. What's the point in this fruit, by the way? Like, pomegranate's really nice, but like, who has the time? Who's going to sit there and do this? You putting the brown ones in. It's weird how it's like an orange, but not. What? It's like an orange in the segments, and like, do you know what I mean? Alright, really I'll do. Pomegranate. Ready? Oh my god, ready for action. So, it's plan of attack. If this is you right now, how would you go about eating this? Face first. No, you wouldn't. Should I do it with no hands? No. Eat the fruit, no hands. Three, two, one, go. That's quite impressive. That's oh, a terrible idea. I'm going to use my hands. I'm actually quite excited because I'm hungry. And this looks good. Um, let's begin. <laughs> Oh, okay. 
Yeah. I'm done. Um, there was a moment there, like two dates ago, where I like properly gag, managed to hold it in. I'm okay. I don't feel full. I feel like I could eat more capacity wise, but I just feel kind of like low key sick, you know? Those dates, like after eating all the normal fruit, those dates are ridiculously sweet, like the friggin. If I had my eyes closed, I think it was I think it was like toffee or fudge or something. Okay. Breakfast is over. Fifteen hundred calories in. See you in a bit. Why is that a yellow card? <laughs> 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 oh, okay. So, situation as follows. Still feeling pretty sick. Can't face the thought of any, any more uh, like sugar slash fruit at the moment. So, like an absolute creep, I'm eating a tomato and a carrot. Now, look at the size of that carrot. Look at the size of that tomato. These are just under 200 calories. Like, that's ridiculous. That's why being a vegan, like, if you're a vegan and you're fat, like, how are you doing that? <laughs> it feels weird. I've never eaten a tomato like this before. So after these, I'm sitting at like 1,700 calories. If you include the kiwi from this morning, I'm gonna finish those, hang out for a bit longer, then probably see you at the gym. We made it to the gym. Pretty cool, right? It's called the Coaching Village. The guys were very kindly let me use the facility, so appreciate it, lads. Right, now today's session is going to be legs, or more specifically squats, which is far from ideal for two main reasons. Firstly, I left my squat shoes, my knee sleeves, and my belt at home, so that's not great. Secondly, more importantly, I've consumed like half a kilo of fiber today, so probably a strong eight to nine out of ten chance. I'm going to poo myself. Anyway, know what you're thinking, Matt? You've done half a day of eating only fruit and veg. We've seen no banana. What's wrong with you? Guys, do you think I've lost my mind? No, I've got an abundance of bananas looking <laughs> looking like worse for wear, to be fair. That rhymes. Um, now, the plan, whoa, this is a terrible seat. The plan is basically uh, work my way through as many of these bad boys as I can whilst I'm squatting. I figured like it's gonna suck anyway. So yeah, do some squats, eat some bananas, let's go. <laughs> God's sake! Ah, oh. okay. A, eating a banana whilst riding a salt bike is incredibly hard. B, ten second rule. Oh no, don't. Floor so dirty as well. C, I feel sick. Um, I've trained legs. I've eaten six bananas. No, if you count this, I've eaten seven bananas. If I finish that, I um. Seven bananas. They're friggin' big ones. A big banana, aka a large banana, is 120 calories. Google it if you don't believe me. That's like what? Quick maths. 848, basically 850 calories. So add that to the total. I'm gonna go and throw up, and then I'll see you in a bit. Two key points. One, I've never eaten a banana for the rest of my life. Two, it's lunchtime and we've come to this place. It's called, I don't know, Drum or something. It's got Drum in the name. Uh, the other's already in there, AKA I had to come back and do a fake parking because I'm committed to YouTube. So if you're not already giving the video a like, go and do it now. Um, yeah, let's go and get some food. And we're in and we've ordered. I'm sat on my own table because I need the space. Uh, they actually, fortunately enough, had like a vegan plate, which I believe is just like a massive uh, bowl of vegetables. I was quite explicit with my requirements here. The woman seemed to be quite cooperative. Uh, the place is pretty sick, by the way, on a massive beach with like huge waves, good um, surfing conditions. It's weird that it's November, right? Like, what the hell? Anyway, food will be here shortly. See you when that happens. We're set. 
I'm joined by Luca. Thanks, bro. What are you doing? You're thieving hands off my carrot. So, this is an absolute score. A minute, bro. Look at this. We've got basically a massive array of various vegetables. Been assured everything here is vegetables. Um, so, I mean, there's carrots. Yeah. What have you got? Uh, I got so I've got vegetables and cranberries. Try it. Good. Try it. Try it. Try it. Try it. Yeah, just like mush vegetables of different types, potatoes, so carrots. I got carrot, I got this. Luca is literally desperate. Luca, you got carrots there already, mate. Look. No. <laughs> I just got red. No, 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 I just got red. Tomato. You want to take it? No, I'll put it here. Okay. Right. Should I do cuts or a time lapse? Uh, a time lapse. Good idea. Can you count me in, please? Three, two, one, go. Done, <clears throat> and that was actually incredible just putting it out there. Like, I'm basically gonna become a vegetarian now. Like, uh, some of the pasty things were quite spicy, and like, by then, not gonna lie, the fiber was definitely having an, uh, an effect in terms of calories. I literally have no idea. I'm gonna try and do some rough, like, rough being the key word here estimates. I'll ask the woman that made the stuff. Oh, by the way, I had some orange juice as well. Luca ate literally one carrot and a bite of bread. Um, yeah, we're done here. See you in a bit. Back home, Luca is in bed. Quick little drinking game for you. Every time I say see you in a bit, see you in a bit, see you in a bit, see you in a bit. In this video, take a shot. Or don't, I've said it about 4,000 times. Now, little known fact about me, I'm actually a world class handstand, uh, handstandist, handstand performer. Just watch this. Oh my god, that's You know, I've conquered handstands and definitely made my camera quite wet. Now, because I'm an absolute weirdo, I keep a string of figs by the pool, typically, on a Wednesday. Um, dried figs, FYI. Can you even see me? Quite watery, oh well, we've started. Uh, 20 calories per fig, ipso facto. That's a friggin' lot of calories. Now, I'm not a freak, I'm not gonna eat all of those. I've already had some enough uh, bowel issues as it is today, so we'll play it safe. Just try and get like a, I don't know, maybe a solid 10, 10? We'll see, see what happens. Number one. Number two. Three, four and five. Six, seven, eight. Stalk on it. What the hell? You meant to eat fig stalks? Nine. Ten. Okay, 10 in, not gonna lie, feeling fine, if anything, like better than before I started. Let's ramp it up, five. Right, it takes me to 15, by the way. I'm starting to feel a bit sick. Let's do five more, make it a nice round 20. You with me? Ugh. Gone, I don't know why I just did that. 20 figs, that's 400 cows by my estimation. Um, that was a weird experience. Anyway, before I forget, I have some exciting news, and that is that Gymshark have given me a 500 pound gift card, and I'm gonna give it to one of you guys, partly because I'm a nice guy, and partly because I'm not allowed to use it myself. So if you would like the chance to win 500 pounds to spend on any Gymshark stuff you like, three small things you've got to do. Firstly, like this video. Secondly, go and subscribe to the Gymshark YouTube channel. And thirdly, click the Gymshark link at the top of my description. Once you've done those three things, and I will check, comment, Matt, you're a sicko. I'll go through the comments, I'll pick one at random, 
and I will announce the winner in next week's video. Good luck. Oh, and possibly the most exciting of all, and I think I'm maybe the first person to be announcing this, but the Gymshark Blackout Sale goes live on the 25th of this month. It's gonna be up to 70% off. It's by far their biggest sale of the year. It's friggin' sick. People go friggin' crazy for it. So what I would suggest is again, click on the Gymshark link at the top of my description, go and choose the stuff you want so that when the sale comes around, you're ready to go and you can buy the stuff. Because there's lots of instances in the past where people have put stuff in their basket and by the time they come to check out, the stuff's gone, right? So be quick, click on the link, choose what you want to get, and then when it comes around to it, you can get the stuff for like friggin' 7p. Okay, that's enough of that. Let's go and eat some more friggin' fruit and vegetables. Some time has elapsed. I've had a shower, feeling good, actually feeling quite hungry, actually frigging craving like salty actual food because I've all eaten, all, all eaten all day is fruit and vegetables. Um, exciting things are happening in the kitchen. I'll catch up with you shortly. Dinner is upon us. Luca, where are your clothes? <laughs> Good. Um, right, everyone's having normal food, aka pasta and stuff. I'm forced to have fruit and vegetables, but put a spin on it, and by spin on it I mean probably cheated, but... Potatoes. Potatoes are a vegetable. Tomato is a, also a vegetable, so... It's a facto, mm -hmm. well within the rules. Cooked in vegetable oil. Cooked in vegetable oil, so I mean. By me. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's that's fine. Um, we have three large potato, no, four large potatoes, aka a thousand calories. When you add in the oil, uh, then I mean it's over. Let's just call it a thousand calories um, to calm the naysayers. Then we have approximately 300 calories of vegetables. By the way, all the fruit and veg you've seen today that I've consumed in this house is stuff we got from the market yesterday. We worked like crazy, epic fruit and vegetable market yesterday. They got loads of friggin' stuff, so all of this stuff is as a result of that. But yeah, in total, through 1,300 calories, which I believe puts me there or thereabouts as far as my total goes, uh, that being 5,000 calories. I'm excited to eat some like salty. I say salty, these aren't salty, are they? Damn it. It's not a vegetable. You can't. Oh. It's not a vegetable. I'm not have salt. Water isn't a vegetable. I've drunk water today. Mm. I'm going find some. <laughs> okay, that does come out quite quickly. The chips are now very salty. I, I am. Luca, goat. Luca is insisting that goat crisps are a thing, but they're. Luca no, I know what he means. It means ghost crisps. Ghost. That's what, what he's mean? saying, isn't it? We keep thinking he's saying ghost. He's saying ghost crisps. <laughs> Ghost Chris, okay. Okay, so Ghost Chris are a thing. So let's get the Ghost Chris, just for clarity. Yes, you can pick these up in the supermarket. These are incredible. Right, um, I'm hungry. Let's eat. <laughs> Done. <clears throat> and that was probably... Possibly the best meal of the day. No, that's a lie. The lunch was actually really like, yeah, all the food's been good. I guess the figs weren't ideal, but yeah, that was the easiest calories that I've consumed. I guess 1300 done. Um, I'll do my final calculations, uh, see where I'm at, and then see you shortly. Hi right, guys, you find me just reclining on the floor like a peasant by the fire. It's actually quite hot. Um, I did my calculations, I'm 10 calories short. Uh, God hates me, but fortunately says doesn't, and she's brought me a Selection. eclectic mix. What is that? Straight away. <laughs> that, this, they look like they're not for a start. I've eaten enough figs, mate. They're not being eaten. What is this? Oh, absolute we monstrosity! That in the market, and it was green, it's but now it got dripping squashed. Everywhere. And I still think you should try it. Right, that looks. There is no way that's edible. That looks like festering. Pus inside of. Don't do that before you eat it. Oh, you're gonna have to try it. What is, what is it? I need ten calories, mate. That looks disgusting. Oh, I think you should try it. Oh, I'm gonna have what it. in God's name is that? Actually, smells quite nice. Smells like yogurt. It's not that bad, but I was prepared for it to be horrendous. So it's not saying much. I reckon that was about four calories, we've got okay. six to go. How many calories in a lemon? Four calories. How many calories That's in a more of this third of a lemon? There you go. I'm not gonna get that away from anyone any more of that. <laughs> Have a date. That was definitely enough. Have a date just to make sure. Date? Sure. See, so, yeah, appropriate on camera. <laughs> we'll get past that. So I've already eaten loads of dates. Just one right, I'll eat half a date. Now, I'm not going to put any more totals on the screen because I think we can all agree I've surpassed my 5,000 calorie target. To be honest, my summary of the day would be that 
It was ways than I thought. I thought it would be much harder to consume that much fibre. Turns out my stomach is a fibre consuming machine, so... Uh, I'll let you know how the video went tomorrow. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Follow my Instagram, link in the description, to find out my bowel movement for the next 24 hours. Going to be interesting, going to be fast paced and action packed. Um, if you want to see a 10,000 calorie fruit and veg challenge, I don't want to do that, so I'm going to have to, I don't know, I'm going to need at least 50,000 likes for that to happen. So if you want to see that, then like the video. If you are new to the channel, subscribe, and I will see you tomorrow. Oh.